so it turns out that there's a very strong correlation between how much we know about people and how much we like them. So our spouses and our, you know, there's all kinds of people that are good friends, are people that we know very well and we like them a lot. And the question is, what is this caused by? Is the liking driving knowing or the knowing driving liking? And what people intuitively think is that knowing driving liking. I learn a bit more about you, I would like you more. I learn more about you, I would like you more. But the reality is that more knowing actually creates less liking. And the reason is the following. Imagine I tell you that I like music. What do you think? That I like Baroque music? No, you probably, your immediate thought is to think that I like something that is like you. But then when you learn what I like, you realize it, we're not as similar to each other. So when you describe things in vague terms, like when you go on, on, online and you fill one of those online dating sites profile, these things are quite vague. And when things are vague, they have lots of place for the imagination of the reader to fill the gap. And especially if you're trying to date somebody, you're looking for dating, you're looking for people who are great, right? So you have, you're motivated to come up with great people, they have something vague, <coughs> you find out all these great things and then you get, you get crushed. <coughs> so, so there is this sense in which vagueness allow our imagination to run wild, to be over-optimistic, and then sadly we get crushed by it. But now you can also ask, so why is it that we believe in this correlation? So how does it happen that our good friends, we know a lot about them and we uh, like them as well? What happened is the opposite process. Imagine you go to colleges, day one you meet a thousand people. You say, oh these 500 I don't care about. These 500 I like, I'll go and have coffee with them. You go to coffee with them. Then 250 you say, ah, so-so. 250 you said, oh I really like those, I'll have lunch with them and you have lunch with them, and so on. So what happened is that because you like people, you keep them as your friends for longer. So in fact, in reality, it's the liking that is driving knowing. The more you like somebody, the more that you stay, stay with you, and then you get more chances to learn more about them and know them better. But if you just take a random person and you just add knowledge, it actually creates less liking. <music>